Gannett. Mount Seymour is one of the three North Shore mountains, along with Frome and Cyprus. I would say Seymour has a bit more downhill type trails and is not afraid to stay gnarly. And that's what I really love about it. Combine that with great weather today, cool temperatures, and an awesome crew, today is going to be a lot of fun. So today I'm riding with Seth Spike Hacks, Christina, also known as Sketchy Trails, and Aiden. Seth and Christina have never been here before, so all of this will be new for them, and a couple trails are new for me as well. Seth was in the area filming for his Dirt Diaries video, and I really wanted to show him some of the cool stuff Mount Seymour has to offer. So we're going to check out trails like CBC, Boogeyman, and Empress. You want to just do incline, get your blood pumping? <laughs> Let's just do it. You, you want to go first? Sure. I love this. <laughs> oh, dude, I love it. Oh. <laughs> I know you used to have a downhill bike on there. Yeah. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> <laughs> Looking back, it just looks so awesome. That's ridiculous. <laughs> yeah, Coke is fun. Dude, yeah, that's some fun stuff, man. <laughs> All right, so John Deere, where we just go up a little bit. Aiden recommended that we ride John Deere first since it's a fast, flowy trail. This one's new to me as well. This is the beginning of John Deere. Pretty cool way to start a trail, I gotta say. So I'm gonna try this line. Let's see how that goes. Okay. Yeah. Holy crap, that was awesome. Oh, I screwed up back there and I was trying to catch off. It was hard, man. You guys are pinning it. Oh, sick. So you just transfer over. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's cool. Woo. After John Deere, the best and most gnarly way to finish is to ride Empress. There's a lot of rock and a lot of fun. You can make it even gnarlier by doing the Huck line. What's the Huck line? <laughs> Come look at it. <laughs> Go up here. Oh, hey, it actually looks kind of cool. So you go up here and you hop over to the rock. Oh, yeah. That's not bad. Uh, well, because we may come down here again next run anyway. Yeah. But I don't know. So we'll definitely come back down here. If we're going to come back down here, then I'll risk it later. Yeah. 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 You want to go first, Seth? Yeah. I'll yeah, I'll go behind you. We'll hold off on the huck line for now, but next run, we'll do it. I actually did it. Okay, let's uh Okay, you guys hit the right line. Oh, that actually doesn't look that bad for some reason. For some reason last time I thought the left line looked easier. I don't know what I was thinking. That was easy. That was sick though. Dude. <laughs> 
this type of stuff doesn't bother me at all because my home yeah. my home park windrock it's yeah. all that oh. another awesome thing about mount seymour is that there's this nice paved road to shuttle up which is pretty necessary for how long the descents are it takes five minutes to drive up but it could take anywhere from 30 minutes to an hour to get down depending on which trails you do and how much you stop so for the second run i really wanted to show seth cbc it starts higher up than the previous trails we rode and it's a really old trail it doesn't get ridden as much but it has so much great rock work and wooden features that you just can't pass this one up. Whoa. Oh. Oh. So gnarly. <laughs> There's a cool rock thing right here. You can go pretty slow off of it. I guess I'll follow one of you guys over it. Sure. Oh. Oh. Here, you don't even need to pedal. <laughs> Send it. Yeah. Definitely like can't see anything until you're right there. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Super sick logs. Oh, man. Take your foot off there. Oh. Yeah, looks good. Nice. Right on. Oh, I love this. How cool is this? How sick is that? Epic log ride. Woo. Sick. Woo. Weird? Yeah, it's like... Whoa! Woo! Send it. Oh! <laughs> yes. That was close. Yeah, I didn't think you could roll it, and you were close to undoing it. Dude, this trail is so North Shore, it apologizes to you when you fall. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, sorry. Oh, man. Yo. Sick. Oh, that was pucker. That was scary. Yeah. Cool. All this rock work with these rock rollers are so satisfying, especially since I got this 8 inch travel DH bike. When you have 8 inches of travel, you really just want to ride stuff that's going to make use of all your suspension. And that's what's so satisfying about just plowing through rock gardens. It's like, wow, I actually am using my bike. <laughs> That was so awesome. That was CBC. Dude. How sick that was, was that? The sickest trail. Yeah, Christina. How sick was that? Sending it. I keep going off running. Yeah, yeah. It's so easy to lose sick. the trail. Yeah. All right, salvation up on the left. 
Salvation is another really interesting trail with some epic wooden features. That's sick. I just want to see what I can do so far. Yeah, you, you can do the turn on the downhill right? You can? Yeah. Oh my goodness! Woo! Sick! Oh, and there's a sick wall right here. I remember that. I get so stoked looking at all these wooden features. Even though I can't do them all, it's just really inspiring to see. Maybe some other time with a smaller bike I'll try out those turns, but not today. Oh. Alright, you got this. Yes. Oh, dude. Ah. This thing is, this thing got me. Oh, man. No idea what I was running into there. I got way too low gear. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so it's skinny up, skinny down with a jump. So you jump to skinny and then gap. Oh my the goodness. Skin. What the heck? This is amazing. And then keep all your speed for the last one. Nice. Yeah. Dude, that's cool. Dude, that was so I cool. I just made it. I, I had to yeah. fuck <laughs> Um, Boogeyman is gonna be a double black. It's got some really cool stuff. Let's do it. Ready to send it? Right, you can go to the left of the job. Cool. Right, Boogeyman. This is some cool stuff. I felt like I was riding at the top of my game today. I was riding here a few weeks back and things didn't go all that well. I had wiped out a few times. But today, I mean, I never crashed and things were just going really great. Don't you just love days like that? Oh, yes. Oh, dude, I hit that way faster this time. Yeah. Woo! Woo! Oh. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> All right. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Pretty cool. There we go. All right. And this is the way we end. Whew. Whoa. Super cool. Getting to a uh, nice gear. If you can pedal up. Not a good gear. Oh. Okay. Good now. Whew. Whew. You gotta be busting on a downhill bike. Yeah. Uh, okay. Standing it. The ending of Boogeyman is especially interesting with its multiple lines and steep rock faces. So cool that Christina was inspired to make a drawing out of it featuring Seth, Aiden, and myself.
This is sick. Woo. Sick. Oh, sick, dude. Woo. Woo. All right, round two of Empress. This time we're trying the Huck line. Oh. oh no! <laughs> Aiden, oh. buddy. Yeah, I can see where it let. Yeah, loose. it kind of can look like you can roll in, and then I guess it just caught yeah, you. It just, yeah, it just was a soft dirt. Yeah, your chest. Oh, oh, stayed on. Nice, dude. Okay, this turn is always difficult for me. Come on. Oh, yes. I've never been so interested in riding tech as I am now with my DH bike. I'm always looking for ways to use this thing to its full potential. I find some of this to be just what the doctor ordered. Right on. With Aiden's crash, the day was done for him, but we were all satisfied after those two long laps. I especially had a lot of fun riding with Seth again, meeting Christina, and just plowing through some gnarly trail was just so awesome. Also, huge thanks to Aiden's mom for shuttling us for those two runs. Yeah, he's all right. okay. Thank you for watching. I want to give a special thanks to my Boostmaster patrons. If you love downhill and free ride or just love riding mountain bikes, then consider subscribing. And if you like to see more content and keep me rolling on two wheels, then check out my Patreon page.